is our nine-planet solar system, which seems happy and complete, but there's just one problem. It lost one of its planets. Their solar system used to consist of nine planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. Well, this is how our solar system was known until 2006, when Pluto wasn't declared to be a planet anymore. But how does a planet just get lost? Well, let's start from the beginning. In 1930, an astronomer was looking at pictures that were taken of the night sky, and when he discovered an object moving with Earth's orbit, it was studied further and was declared the planet Pluto. Then, technology and telescopes improved, and Pluto started to stick out from all the other planets. It didn't fit in with its neighboring extraterrestrial planets. It also didn't fit with the same orbit pattern of all of its other fellow planets. Its orbit extends past all of our planet's orbits and into the Kuiper Belt. So, the fact that Pluto is very different from its fellow planets gave the first clues that it is not even a planet at all. To make it official, scientists declared that a planet has to orbit around a star, be round, and clear the neighborhood around its orbit. Pluto follows the first two rules, but it never cleared out the area around it. Pluto is located in the Kuiper Belt along with other objects exactly like Pluto, such as Charon and Eris. In fact, there are 70,000 other objects with the same size and composition of Pluto. So, it would be easier to throw out Pluto than to have 70,000 nine planets. But don't worry, even though Pluto isn't a planet, it is still a dwarf planet and an important part of our solar system.